Ventilation is another area about which many colleagues are concerned. There is still much discussion and debate within the medical academic community around the role of aerosol spread of COVID-19 and whether this is through direct inhalation or through the contamination of surfaces. The guidance from the government is clear. We need to have good ventilation of our spaces. However, what isn't clear is what this actually means. So there's a number of things that the college has done to attempt to address this issue. We have reviewed all of our air conditioning units to ensure that they draw fresh air from outside and then deposit the used air back outside. This means that COVID cannot be spread within buildings by the air conditioning units. Where we have buildings with rooms that are particularly stuffy and poorly ventilated, we have removed them from the timetable. We are currently investigating the other rooms in between these two extremes and where necessary we can put additional ventilation or reduce capacities or even take them off of the timetable. Unfortunately, there is a large degree of personal responsibility on lecturers to open doors or windows, regardless of the weather conditions, to ensure good ventilation. The College will continue to monitor the guidance and investigate other ways of providing better ventilation.